What is up everyone? Welcome back to another video today and we are welcoming a brand new model airport to the channel. Um, it's an airport that I have recently visited for an air show and probably some of you viewers can probably guess what it is. So ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to welcome you to Duluth International Airport, the model version of it of course. So this airport's quite small, um, about four gates, and they only get three airlines, um, United, and then they have their regional subsidiary, United Express, American Eagle, and Delta Connection. I don't think the Delta Main Line flies to Duluth, as far as I know. But yeah, kind of a small airport. Didn't take me long to make, maybe another 30, 45 minutes. I was kind of delayed by making the airport because of a thunderstorm that rolled in, so I decided to check that out. But yeah, it's now complete and ready for its first update. So we're setting a time frame around 5 a.m. So plenty of traffic here and they're all about ready to go. So here's a much better view of Duluth. Kind of get a kind of get a good idea of what it looks like. Um, there are like tiny buildings that extend out from the main building right here, but I don't have the materials to make it, so I just kind of stuck it to the side of my bookshelf and yes um, this is below my um, Joe Foss airport that I have my model version of Joe Foss that update will be coming out next week so first Friday of the month will be the Duluth International Airport updates probably won't be much coming out of those but I'll try to make it as, as, as exciting as possible for you guys also another thing you might note that I'm already pointing now pointing to are these lights so these are the lights that I decided to put in because it gets kind of dark down here and I figured it would be a nice little thing to do to make it nice and bright so you guys can see what's going on at the airport. So we'll proceed over to this plane right about now. All right, so at gate four, we're gonna be working in a descending order of the number of gates because they, they kind of number them weird because one's at the right and then four is at the left. So we're looking at gate four. This is an American Eagle Embraer ERJ-135. Um, they do fly the 145s to Duluth, but I do not have a, um, a 145 in my collection, so we'll have to pretend that it's a 145 even though it's a 135. He's going to be heading out to Chicago O'Hare pretty soon, and he's already got the tug on him, and he is about ready to go. Sitting next to him is a United Express Bombardier CRJ200. This is the battleship gray version because, like I've said several times, I couldn't find the Continental Globe, so I have to settle with the battleship gray. He's also going to be heading out to Chicago here. They, um, American and United, they seem to have the a little, little thing going on, a little partnership, even though they're in different alliances. But they both fly to Chicago O'Hare on a daily basis, and I think that's really the only only destination that they have besides Minneapolis for Delta Connection, but the first um, Delta Connection flight, I believe that does not come until later in the day, so you won't see a Delta flight here, unfortunately. I believe they might occupy Gate 2, correct me if I'm wrong on that, but uh, yeah. And finally, at Gate 1 is this United Airlines Airbus A319, and can you guess where he's heading? Chicago O'Hare. <laughs> That's pretty much it for um, all the planes that are here during this time of the morning, around 5 a.m. Um, they all departed around 6 a.m., but the American Eagle, the crew is a little impatient, so they are going to get him going as soon as possible. I don't know why, but I guess the crew, they just like to get going as early as possible, even though that, I guess they just don't really allow that much. But anyways... Yep, so all three are going to be heading to Chicago, and then there will be a Delta Connection flight that will arrive later today. I don't know what gate um, each airline operates out of. I know American Eagle, they have some operations at gate four over here, but I'm not sure of the other airlines. So if anyone knows how the gate assignments are at Duluth, please comment below. I would highly appreciate it so I can get this airport better organized um, for the airport updates. That's kind of what I did with Joe Foss. I looked out, looked off some info that I found on the internet for the gate assignments. So the next update for Joe Foss is going to look a little more organized. I'm planning to do a morning update as far as I'm concerned, but there's gonna be plenty of planes and I'm sure the update will be a little more exciting for you guys. So with that being said, um, that concludes the update. Thanks for watching and I will catch you in the next video.